with a badass. <laughs> hey, what's up? My name is Paul Ripke and uh, you're here with Daily Ripke. So this guy <laughs> is out of uh, control. I brought my friend Oskar Backe, a great photographer from Sweden. The amazing guy, how the Swedish would say it. And we are all friends of Jun Olsen. So if you like Jun Olsen, you're good to watch a little bit of Warner's Live. So let's spin it to the next one. <laughs> that was amazing. So good to see good you. To see you man. Good to see you, dude. So this whole thing started two days ago when Paul left me this message. My man, Sky f***ing <laughs> How are you? I hear you're in LA. I hear you have the biggest mansion ever. Part of me wants to meet you and hang out with you. Another part of me wants to hang out that cool mega mansion. <laughs> you can decide if it's 10% and 90%. Let's hang, brother. So is it 10% little... hanging out with me and 90% doing a photo shoot? Which one are we at? Like why I'm here? 95% <laughs> hanging out with you because oh. I adore you as a friend. Oh, Sometimes you can combine <laughs> things to a win-win situation, so. We're just about to get started and I've always wanted to do a kicking it with a badass like as the badass is actually doing what they're really good at. So we're gonna go over and hang out with Paul. See how he does this This thing? No way. That's how I do daily. What up, what up, what up, what up? It's your boy, Paul Roof. <laughs> so today we're using a Leica M10, uh -huh. 24 millimeter, 1.4. That's my weapon of choice pretty much 90% of the time. Because Instagram is working better in vertical and 50 millimeter. I have a second camera because with this camera, I normally only shoot horizontal and that's my vertical camera. That's and then drone. drone. Mavic 2. Yeah. Podcast mic, wherever I am, I'm doing a podcast. It's called Better Call Paul where you can call in and ask for my advice. So, if you wanna call me, I'm there to His do His number's right here. 1844 Ripke LA. But before we dive into this video, let's meet two stars. This is Jade the model and Mormira the makeup artist. Too bad I filmed them in slow-mo for the introduction. Are we gonna see all of this today? I hope so, I mean, a places to shoot in this house. Everything open now, please. Is your job in here? On it. Paul, how are we doing? Bad, bad weather. I'm not happy with the weather. A little higher? Very straight, stay straight. Eyes to your feet, your feet. Yeah, perfect. And towards me. Thank you. Yeah, now right shoulder up. I've never seen Paul shoot before. Oh yeah, once. What, yeah, what do you think? Is he killing it? Is this good? Is this bad? Sucking. I think he's sucking too. God, look at the angle. He's about to trip. <laughs> do you think he can hear us? <laughs> yep, you can lean back. We have sunglasses. I think actually, I think I have a perfect pair for you. I think I have a perfect pair of sunglasses for you. so good! Is this just what you're looking for? I need to analyze the cloud movement, which oh. is very strange. Because there's two layers of cloud, one low, one high. So this is where you see how the clouds change. It's I'm like going down to the cars, okay. shooting at the car. Feel free to join me. <laughs> Can you put the sunglasses on? I can't quite, I can't take okay. you seriously without them. <laughs> there we go. I'm not happy with the light. Sorry, I'll talk to nature. Why are you staying upstairs? <laughs> no, it's just cool to watch you walk like this. Is this like party moment? Party moment. Spin to the next location, Warner. I forgot to swing to the next location. Oh, I hate spins. <laughs> Stop spinning. The world has spun too many laps. 
No more sprint. <laughs> Paul, yeah. talk to me about the light. So it's uh, cloudy, which is uh, very unusual. And you can see normally there the sun is uh, going down, which is the best light of the day, the last two hours of the day, or the first two hours. In LA, almost always the last two hours. And today is a very special day because all of that rain during the day washed down the smog. It's like the clearest view in quite a long time I've seen. You ready? <laughs> She's ready. Might even be cool with this one. Like salt, yeah, salt, yeah. There's like one guy with a camera who keeps asking the same question. <laughs> a little annoying. The biggest problem uh, on shootings if somebody out of your team, like the assistant or the vlog guy or the behind the scenes whatever guy, is too loud. <laughs> That's a big problem. Yeah. Because then he kind of takes over the whole shoot and uh, the model doesn't concentrate it. You get the little hint. <laughs> So am I in the way too much? Not at all in the way, you're just too loud. <laughs> we'll work on that for the next no. next couple minutes. S some, some of the people say, you know, like we need a shadow. You're not a shadow. Here's some sun. Paul's crushing it, but we're just having a really good time flying the drone right now. <laughs> this is awesome. Right, Oscar? Yes. for the stupid for those clouds to go away here's some real content music is the most important thing on shootings you mean like background music yeah it's very important okay. because it loosens up people and, and people get aware so it's better for shooting second of all there's three ingredients for a good picture number one is the content of the picture what's on the picture what's your position where is it what's going on so think about it a lot because some people think yeah that's what I see I'm gonna try to take a picture change the location change the time you're shooting change the place you're shooting that makes a better picture second of all is the talent there is a thing called talent so the person who's shooting it makes the difference of a picture like the talent if you think of different stuff and the third is only the gear that's where a lot of geeks spend way too much time on on gear because it's not about the gear it's the easy way to change things I need a different lens I need a different camera I need a drone I need whatever you need an iPhone and you should work on number one the location and the content of a picture to make a picture better maybe a little bit on number two to train yourself and that's also a rip key to success train because that's something nobody I'm training I'm doing daily rip key on IGTV to train myself to like practice because uh, like as a, if you're a professional sports star a skier you train over the week if you're a professional photographer normally you don't train you're always shooting so I'm trying to push myself to train stuff and that's something you should do you need to take a lot of pictures I probably took around 50 million pictures in my life that's why maybe my 50 million and first picture is a little bit better than the second one i took in my life so that's i trained a lot Do I enjoy being in a cold pool or yeah. do I enjoy shooting? Shoot. Both. I enjoy shooting. It's my job and I'm obsessed with it. And I wouldn't want to be doing anything else. God, you're, you're looking slim. <laughs> Not totally sure will Paul take his shirt off, but I know maybe it helps. So we're going to try to do a fly through right there. Should be sick. What up, what up, what up, what up? This is the second episode, three minutes ago. How was the shoot? It was amazing, I'm warming up now. Great job. <laughs> Thank you. Paul, but you're the real star of this. Paul's the real star. Oh. So I hope you liked uh, spending a day with a badass. And I have one more thing to say. I'm really waking up a couple of times in my life where I'm really happy to have days like this. It's insane. Whatever happened, whoever did that, gracias, that I'm having this life. You should follow Daily Ripkey on IGTV. It is my daily life. Tomorrow it will be like this again. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this kicking it with a badass episode. And uh, we got a few Q&A questions coming up for you. Are we good like that? Am I talking to you or to the camera? Do you think alpine skiing is more badass than Formula One? It is for sure. 
because I used to be an alpine skier. I'm a Nordschwarzwaldmeister, which is the northern <laughs> parts of the Black Forest in Germany. Really? Yeah, we, we had this conversation a couple of times. <laughs> After you've been impressed by my skiing in New Zealand, you were deeply impressed yeah, in there. Yeah, very impressed. Fuck you, it was really <laughs> like that. You were impressed. You said a thousand Paul, Paul's times. actually a pretty good skier. Yeah, it's, it's true. A, like, a it's it's totally that. all right. And I won when I was 14 and 15. I won two titles of Black Forest champion in Germany. But alpine skiing is by far better than Formula One driving. Wow. More badass. How did you shoot Lena's music video? I shot it on an iPhone and on a Leica SL, this camera. Just turned it around. So it was, after editing it was kind of annoying. If somebody out there knows a solution for Premiere, Adobe Premiere, when you see what, what's on the footage, you kind of look through the footage. You always have to look <laughs> horizontal through it and it's very hard judging it. Uh, hit me up in the comments below to, uh, I really want to have that solved. That would be sick. I did film everything in 16 by 9 by 16 and there's a helicopter. all those stupid helicopters that's why I, I sold my place my place was next to it like a <laughs> little sure. little bit bigger but it's annoying with the helicopters and a lot of the stuff I shot on iPhone with a moment lens which is a lens you adapt to a camera boom, and then turn it around great company great product moment lens I'm not endorsed by them nothing to do with them it's just a great product sickest babe you've ever shot sickest babe I've ever shot is always the last one Jade uh, you've just seen what happened today it was uh, uh, epic. Can we put in some pictures right now? Uh, yeah. Da, 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 da. Boom. <laughs> Did you like it? Sure. What do you think of Jade? She's great. Great model, great looking, great personality, very friendly, great boyfriend, insane, uh, like very, very friendly and very professional. And she understood what the story was I wanted to create and very good. When will you rock with Yoon again? <laughs> you, who's Yoon? No, I'm, I, I, I'm looking forward to rock with Yoon again. He's cool. I really like him. Do you love Formula One? Um, I don't care about Formula One, the racing part. Um, I care about the people in Formula One. But I'm starting to get a little bit into it. It's my fourth year now. <laughs> and like the last race was Australia last weekend. And I got excited in qualifying. I was like, oh, also it's getting me slowly because I spend enough time, I guess. But I don't like racing. I don't like driving fast. I really hate if somebody goes fast and I've been put in cars with Lewis Hamilton and stuff. And it's horrible because there's a reason behind it. I'm stupid. My brain is small. My head is very big. <laughs> and if I go fast, the small brain goes to the back of the head and I get dizzy. Very, like, it's, I'm not kidding, it is for real. That's why I don't like racing. Favorite beer? Tegernseer, German, Southern uh, Tegernseer beer. Amazing. Oh, How do you get such an amazing beard? Uh, you just let it grow <laughs> and it gets gray. I'm not sure if it's that good, but it is a sick beard. I'm happy about my beard. Do you have a single pair of pants? Uh, what does that mean? I think everyone sees you wearing shorts. Yeah, I'm always wearing shorts. Uh, that's my kind of uh, signature because I'm so fat and I'm sweaty always and I get hot That's the real reason and because I can Have how cool is Snoop that? No, Not, no, no picture of Snoop Doggy Dog uh, What are we watching on Sky Movies? That's from what Sean. are we mo Sean McKenna my friend? What's <laughs> up, bro? Right now I would watch a documentary about the diabetes fraud kind of thing. Worst HBO. photo you ever took? Worst photo was probably New Zealand because I had, it was not a real picture, but we flew in there. That's where Matt Warner. We uh, waited five days till we could get up and then they were bitching about the wind and Ewan Olsen was not jumping because he said, yeah, no, ooh, too much wind may over jump it and whatever. So I just took a background picture of the sick kicker and then another person, I when I they the jumped, Warner Nickers and took a picture when Ewan was jumping. Five days later, we photoshopped it together, looked horrible, the whole thing, <laughs> totally mess, fucked it up, but they still talk to me, so that's all right. And a wedding. I, I, I took very bad pictures at a wedding, never doing that again. Best place to photograph a wedding. So that yeah, just don't. Yeah, if you if you have talent, yeah, there's great wedding photographers out there. I suck at it. You had a really good first podcast. Warner, have you ever thought about having one of those? Fifty two lunch dates with <laughs> Warner Nickerson coming up into your podcast player. iTunes, Deezer, Spotify, hit it up. Warner Nickerson's podcast is coming up and it's gonna be lit. Boom. Who's gonna win this year, Formula One? Um, I'm pretty sure Lewis Hamilton will win his title number. Six. There's a few others, but that's all we have for tonight. Thank Shh. you very much, my friend. Shh. Okay, can you please leave my place now? Like, <laughs> I did like to no, stop laughing and with that shit. Come on. <laughs>
just take your stupid camera and leave. That was enough of it. <laughs> Those friends coming in and we have like, can you